Hello everyone. In this demo, I'm going to show you how you could automate Google Workspace products, such as Gmail and Google Drive in SPA. The use case that I've chosen for this is a sales order creation in S4HANA. And the scenario for the demo is going to be as follows. First, we have a mail in our Gmail inbox uh, with a subject purchase order. And this has an attachment, which is the purchase order. So it is a PDF. So I'll just show you the PDF. So in this, we have uh, the purchase order number, the delivery address, and also the different items that needs to be purchased. And then what we're going to do is that we're going to create a bot and the bot would basically search the Gmail inbox and read this particular email and download the attachment to the file system. Once the attachment is in the file system, we're going to use the SAP Docs service to read the attachment and then basically extract the information from the PDF into a data object. And then this data object would then be fed into an S4 sales order creation bot, which would then go ahead and post, this, post the data into the S4 HANA system. And once the sales order is created, we're going to take the ID and then reply back to this uh, email with the sales order ID. So let me first, before running the bot, let me first show you on how the bot will look like. So this is the basic out, uh, uh, outline of the bot where we have this, we are searching the Gmail for, a, for this purchase order, and then we are reading it and downloading the particular purchase order to the file system. And then we have purchase order extraction, which is, as I said, which is going to use the SAP doc service and get the data and then finally post it into S4HANA and the order ID would be sent back as a reply to the original mail. So now I will run the bot. The data is currently being extracted after searching and reading emails have been done. The extraction is complete. Now we're going to post the data to S4HANA. The sales order is being created right now. And it is completed. And we have a sales order ID at the top. It is 2827. And let us just go see the status of the automation. The automation is completed and it says the reply has been sent back to Gmail. And let me just go to the Gmail, see for the reply. I'll refresh this page. Yeah, so we have an email ID. We have an email over here, which says the sales order has been created with the ID that was, which I've just shown you. Thank you.